this video, I'll be showing you how to fix your connection is not private on Google Chrome. This is quite a simple fix and I'm going to show you exactly how to do this. Actually, you have two ways in which you could work around this error that you're getting. And this usually happens when you're trying to browse a website which is not secure or it does not have any, well, it has a new updated domain and it is trying to redirect you to the new domain. So what you could actually do is to click on advanced and as you can see here, this server could not provide that it is simply pdf.com because as I've said, the domain has been updated or other issues could be that the time on the computer is not set. You could actually choose to proceed to the website and this is typically an unsafe method to do that. So what I would advise you to do is to click on turn on enhanced protection. So if you should click on turn on enhanced protection, it will launch settings. And from the settings panel, it is in privacy and security. So you could actually go to privacy and security from the settings and you'd be in security. So from privacy and security, you click on security. And as you can see here, these are the various protection levels which Google Chrome offers. So you have enhanced protection, standard protection or no protection. So typically at times it would on it would be on no protection or standard protection if you are having issues with these websites. So if you wanted to access this website, you'd simply click on enhanced protection and that would be it. Go back to the website and let's try to refresh and see what would happen. Now, as you can see, it is saying that the connection is still not private. Now, the reason for this is that the website that I'm actually trying to access has a new URL. So it is not allowing me to actually access this URL. So you could actually choose to proceed. And once you've proceeded, it will automatically redirect you to the new URL. So this is basically the new URL for this website. And it is basically good to go. The next time you try to access this website, you will have access freely and securely. So once more to review, you'd simply need to go to privacy and security go to security and enable enhanced protection for your browser. You could also disable enhanced protection if you feel pretty safe and disabling enhanced protection will allow you to just simply go through without any issues. So that is basically it for this video. I hope this was helpful in getting you to actually bypass this privacy error on Google Chrome. So thank you for watching. See you in the next video.